Here we are with a couple of truly sport hatchbacks. The all-conquering Civic R and the less conquering JCW Mini Cooper. But before we go on, we are not testing these two cars on the track. If you nope. want to see the Civic Type R square off against the Subaru WRX STI and the Volkswagen Golf R, check out driving.ca for the full track test. Two, no, we couldn't get the Focus RS. Thanks for asking, maybe another time. So now, let's get on with the actual review. Now look, this is the ugliest car I have ever seen. You just, we haven't even driven them yet. You can't judge a book by its cover. Let's, let, 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 nope, let's get in, let's get in. Fine. Honda Civic Type R. Type R. 306 horsepower, eh? That's a lot. I gotta admit, the shifter is the, the, delightful. The shifter is easily my favorite part of this car. It is so easy. It reminds me of the ES2000. Steering is tight. You could use a little bit more feedback, but it is very, very, very direct. Very aggressive tires. Oh, oh yes. This is way too boy racers for me. The full carbon trim, the shiny red metallic bits. Seats are really good, this, I have to admit. At the end of the day, it is a Civic. Good room, good legroom, good headroom. The back seat's roomy enough. Yeah, it is a usable performance car. There's no doubt about it. My biggest complaint is its lack of subtlety. Let it go. <laughs> uh, that's amazing. <laughs> All right, well, let's hop into the Mini. Let's go drive it. Ew, your car is really dirty. It's filthy. It's disgusting. It's, oh my God. All right, old dude, where do we find ourselves now? We find ourselves in the delightful bantamweight JCW Mini. Well, it suits you, and not just because your shirt matches. And do you think that was coincidental? No. The interior is lovely in this car. It's much better integrated. It's a richer interior. Six-speed manumatic. What are you gonna do? It's a good automatic. It's a great automatic. It shifts cleanly, but you lose that feel that you get that involvement. Otherwise, I really like the way this car drives. It's a lightweight vehicle. It's responsive. The steering is very well weighted. And it makes a lot more noise than the Type R. This is a performance vehicle, but it's a different class. It's a different class. It's a smaller car. It's designed to be as I said, a club racer. It's not designed for pure drag strip acceleration. It's meant for being speedy. I am blown away by the performance of this car. It is delightful. The only thing is Honda took every cliche from the tuner handbook and pasted it to this car. It's too bad. I mean, here's the thing. The Mini Cooper JCW makes me feel like a young man. In this, I look like I stole my grandson's car. I can look past the Civic Type R's ungainly looks because, simply because of how absolutely incredible it drives. The power delivery in this thing is absolutely nuts. It goes like stink. It reminds me of the S2000. It does. And for just about $40,000 versus forty-five dollars as tested for the Mini. As tested. This is an absolute performance bargain. It is, I have to grant you that. I love the way it drives. I really wish it didn't look the way it did, but it does. Still, I do like the Civic R. Type R for me. Type R for me. For Driving.ca, I'm Brian Harper. And for Driving.ca, I'm Nick Trejanis. <laughs>